the animation on my screen, Costas. I do. Yeah, on, on the... Yeah, so that's the one that I've already done. Ooh, nice. Um, it keeps loading on and off for me. I mean, if you're, I guess if you're sharing on Discord with me, then uh, is this going to slow down your stream? Uh, I don't know. Um... Yay, now I got my own private stream. Okay, cool. Yeah, it looks great. Okay, so... Uh, Ooh, that's really nice. <laughs> let me just check if the quality's still okay. Yeah, I guess if he's... Um, the, 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 the spraying one is going to be looping for a while, depending on like how long we want him to... Oh, it looks pretty good. Oh yeah, you would loop the end frames depending on how long. Yeah. I don't know. It's probably long enough. Well, let's see it with the fire eventually, but you know. It's, yeah. Um. Uh, it's pretty cool how like so you match the frames, uh, the frame rate with a GIF, right? So that helps, I guess. I match the frame rate with the GIF. I have not. This is just um. Uh, on twos. I don't actually know what a sprite does. Um, well, it looks it looks perfect. So I can show you what I did <laughs> so. was I took. So for example, this is the animation that you did for me. I mean, wait, let me get rid of that. I did it for everyone, but yeah. <laughs> yeah, this is this is the rough animation <laughs> that you did, right? Uh, sure. Yeah. Oh, yeah. That's at the. That's not. That's the gif. Okay, cool. Um, then I took that. And it's the correct size, I hope. Yeah. Um, and then I, I took, I counted each frame. And then I put a little tag above each one to say like the length of how long each one's held for, right? So the oh, frame's nice. held for 12. Then um, I deleted all the extra ones. So the one that you see here that I'm going to be working on is not at the correct. Um, okay. So you reverse the engineered timing. the GIF basically for the to find the frame rate in a way. Well, not the GIF. I, I took your um, your actual. Um, oh, because it has numbers you didn't, on it. You didn't. No, you didn't delete the extra frames on the spaceman one. Oh, whoops. Otherwise, I oh, normally yeah. go by numbers. Um, so yeah, <laughs> little turtle. You see? Are you looking at the chat, Carlos? Yeah, there's a pixel turtle there. I don't know how it got there, but it looks cool. It's um, I drew it. Um, and it's oh, it's nice. it's Laurie's emote on his channel. <laughs> okay, that's pretty cool. <laughs> Okay, so uh, okay, so your your animation that you did with the roughs was kind of confusing because like it looks like the animation starts. Oh wait, this isn't the one. Um... Hey, it's Matt is in the chat. Oh, hey, Matt. Um. Yeah, it looked like the. Oh wait, is this fixed as well? Like at the end of the animation, after it's like flown away. You have two mm -hmm. two things of the fire extinguisher doing its thing. So I'm guessing those are meant to be at the beginning. Um, yeah, I don't know what that is. Um, so uh, what oh, I did okay. is I took those two extra frames, or yeah, and I put them at the start. Um, is, is sure. that I fine? Mean, technically, we don't need, even need them. I guess we just need the... I, I think that these were there just to tell you where you need to place them. Well, uh, this, this frame isn't actually in the other animation. Which is why I was confused. Oh, it's it. not. Yeah, yeah, it's not like this. The the one before. Yeah, this one is. This one is okay. So the idea is that um, this animation, the the one I told you at loops, the one with a with a spring, that's like a little loop of him spring. Yep. It's like I'm like I'm not explaining anything that's sad, but sure. Um, like okay, so this little loop this animation after this. Oh, this oh, oh this. So, are you talking about this? This right. Yes, so this one, yeah. Th yeah. This one is supposed to loop, and then this one is supposed to be triggered while this is looping, basically. So it's like sprays the last bit of a uh, yeah, okay. fire, fire extinguisher fluid, whatever, and then it just like pops off. Oh, actually, actually, oh, that's not can fine. I? Mm -hmm. th this new animation, this animation uh, that we're just talking about, not this one, the other one, the one when it goes flies away. Yeah, this one. Uh, it's supposed to be uh, happening twice, the little spring, uh, the poof, poof. So, so it. Does it make sense? Yeah. Okay, that, that, cool. It does happen twice, right? It happens twice, and then it yep. pauses for a while, and then it flies away, yeah. Yeah. 
Yeah, okay, cool, cool. So let me get started on it. I don't need to do this, but... This feels really weird with people watching, but hey. <laughs> hey, Matt retweeted. Thanks, Matt. Nice. Well, next time we'll do a stream, hopefully we'll do it with uh, Matt making a cool background and uh, me saying cool puns. We'll see uh, which one is cooler. Uh, <laughs> the drawing or the punishment. Uh, I'm drawing a bug thingy. Um, I mean, wait. Cool. I don't know if you want to share it with everyone because it might not even be a final one, but I'm not gonna be able to easily because I'm just sharing my A sprite screen. Unless I copy paste it. Okay, hold on. Uh oh you're so okay, you're not the sharing this stuff. I can copy paste it into A sprite though. What the heck am I doing? <laughs> Okay, the chat is demanding puns, so I gotta be on my uh, A game here. <laughs> Pretty sure Matt is paying them secretly for me to say more puns. <laughs> Alright, so let's make the smoke pink, right? I didn't even actually, I didn't think about it until now, but I wasn't sure if you were planning to have a webcam or not, or this is just this no, is no. technically our first. Uh, for our first uh, stream, so. Yeah, I, I didn't want to muck around with webcams. I just wanted to get on with the work that I need to do and to stream it as well, because, I don't know, I think it's pretty cool for people to see the process if they want to. Sure, yeah. Sarah says to make sure your puns are punny. All I gathered from this comment is that uh, that's Sarah on the chat. <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Hi, Sarah. How can I see who's watching? <laughs> Well, it depends on your attitude, Matt, I guess. <laughs> if you put the bar really, really, really low, then they're all enjoyable. <laughs> oh no, Matt is fighting back. <laughs> attitude. <laughs> These ones are frithy. What does that even mean? Uh, it's supposed to be a pun on filthy, but that oh, filthy! Completely, <laughs> com completely didn't work out, but sure. No, sir, it's not supposed to be pink. Of course, it's meant to be pink. Is this a copy? Like the same frame? It is, isn't it? Well, this one's going a lot quicker than I thought it would. <laughs> <laughs> I'm just copy pasting what? everything. Really? I was like, oh, I'll just All do right. an animation on stream, and like yeah, an animation you, you, takes me a while. Okay, these are gonna like, be better. Okay, uh, you you've already done like half of this anyway. Uh, that's what I'm that's saying. Why, <laughs> that's why I asked you when it was starting. I was like, did you actually animate this? Already, yeah, but but um, and it's going to be different now soon. It'll be fine. It's like everyone's wondering why the hell is he having a fire extinguisher? But... <laughs> yeah, that's like the kind of annoying thing is that he's like from another planet, right? <laughs> so well, you, you you think that they wouldn't their fire extinguisher wouldn't look like our fire extinguishers, but. We can't do something super crazy with no text because everyone yeah. needs to, to know what it is. Um, and this is like the yeah. easiest way, I guess. Oops. Yeah, I mean, we, we could have like the trippiest. And also there is like a pixel aspect ratio that we can't really, you know, make it too crazy. Even if it looked different, it's also going to look minimal yeah. with the pixels. So, yeah. yeah. I mean. yeah.
What is going on here? You find the same frame. This frame? So what are you doing designing a, an insect? Yeah, I'm doing like a really colorful kind of fly thing. Uh, cool. Are you using reference for it? Or are you just like yeah. making it up? Did you yes, find I, I, like I a... found one in my bathroom. Yeah, I actually found the reference. <laughs> <Okay>. but... <laughs> <laughs> well, I found one today. There was a massive like um, fly in the kitchen. Um, but it's like a you get flies here that like pretending to be wasps, but they're not wasps, they're flies. What, like with, with little coats? How are they pretending yeah. to be? <laughs> They've got little little like Halloween costumes on. They look like a wasp, <laughs> but they, they fly like a fly. I guess it, and buzz I guess like Halloween, a fly. So make, that yeah. makes sense. Yeah. <laughs> they still freak me out though. Probably keep this. I hate drawing things at angles. Oh, good. good thing you told. Oh, you mean as in like rotated or? Yeah, that's yeah. exactly what I was doing now with this fly. I was rotating it, so maybe you should have it straight. I guess. Um. Yeah, I mean that butterfly we did worked out fine. Just you know the yeah the tiny one, but uh, that's like three pixels and it looks like a butterfly. Yes. Yeah. Not sure if no one's uh, chatting up in the stream or if I'm just like uh, not refreshing anything here. No, I think it went quiet. Oh, okay. There are eight people watching my... now, and I can't tell who's watching. So, it says 10 for me, but my... Um... Oh, okay, cool. But, uh, yeah, it's a bit weird with my stream, because it keeps, like, loading all the time, so it's probably my internet if no one else is complaining. Yeah. What is this Space uh... Age program you <laughs> Um, Ace Bright. It's a pretty good uh, pixel art program, and it's affordable. I don't know why, I, yeah, I should like be sponsored by them. <laughs> um, Cossus, do you know how people use fire extinguishers? Uh, <laughs> why, why is this wrong? <laughs> but this one's fine. It, it's, it's, what, can I see it in this one? I don't know. Um, yeah, see, so on a fire extinguisher, you have that, yeah, yeah, that handle, you, you've got it on yeah, the wrong side. Handle. You're meant to squish that for the, the like foam to come out. Uh, sure. Yeah, the, it's on the top of it, right? There's like a little. Yeah, but the the, the thing you press. Yeah, the thing that you the two the two handle type things, right? That stick out like a beak. Yeah. They're the yeah. two that you're meant to press, so they should be on the other side of the hose. Um, but it's fine because I I just faked it kind of. See, look, okay. like here on this okay. one, I've done. Okay. I put it on the right <laughs> side, and then it works. It works. Oh, okay. That, that's actually better because you can see the silhouette, so it kind of looks more like uh... Yeah, yeah. Matt's pixeling for something else. <laughs> <laughs> I know what that is. Oh, wait, uh, I was supposed to send you a fly secretly, unless you wanted to share it. Um... Is this the fly that you're drawing, like your actual drawing or reference? Well, I did draw it. If 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 you think it's fine, uh, I could just like start animating it or something. Yeah, yeah, show it to me. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So this is the first uh, this uh, area that Sarah is animating. This, I mean, particular animation is for the first playable area where it's uh, just the snake. <laughs> So. What the hell are the, is the um? What do you call it? The details you're putting on it. <laughs> well, I mean, it's this better is... than complete ignorance of the <laughs> whatever it, we're it's, doing. It's funny because like I'm not going to be able to do to show that. To, um, oh, that like. thing you mean? Oh, I thought the the details in my story. Uh, yeah, the oh, yeah. I, don't, I was having fun with it, but yeah, but I I wasn't sure how big to make it. That's why I was. Uh... He looks really cool, but he also looks like he's like from the spaceman's world or something. Like he, it's blue with like. An arrow on it, you know, it reminds me of like it looks like a uh, what space do you call flight. It? I don't know. Yeah, yeah, but I, I'm not going to be able to do that kind of detail, am I? Am I? Not really. But that's cool. Uh, 
the wings are really nice as well. Yeah, I thought I would add some colors there, but uh, I guess you can't see them, so maybe I can add them more prominently. Uh, also, I wasn't sure how big to make it. How big is it, like, fine as a size? Uh, it still seems really big. Um, yeah, but it's, like, it's supposed know, to be a bit big for it to, like... It, can it can it fly like with the fact that he's meant to be big and chunky? Can he fly like in a really like slow kind of way because he's too heavy to like fly properly? Do you yeah, know what I mean? Even if it doesn't, it can fly like in little circles and end up where we want it to be. Uh, does that make sense? Yeah, I just thought it, it looked cool to make it funny. I guess. Yeah, but it has to be a bumblebee or like a beetle, I guess. To, to do yeah, that. yeah, no, the, the fly works. I think. Maybe. A what? I, I said that fly works, would work, I think. I think so too. I mean, I could make it a little oh, bit faster. Oh, wait, I guess, I guess with that kind of thing, it's because the wings are meant to be smaller than the actual body, is why it makes it funny, because the, the wings are too small to carry that weight. Like on a, a bee or something like that. Do you know what I mean? Not exactly. So for something that's like flying, that's really. It, you you want to show that it's too heavy to be able to fly properly. Yeah. Um, it would be because the wings are too small. So if there's too... like, if you can tell that the body's way bigger than like the wings are, they're just saying like for a com, com like a comedic kind of like cartoony kind of thing. That's the way they'd probably do it. I'm not saying we should do it. Yeah, they would. I'm not sure if anatomically it would work, but let's uh, try and see what it looks <laughs> like with shorter. Thanks for the people watching, by the way. No problem, I'm watching everyone. Follows are always welcome. I want to attempt to get affiliate, I need like 50. I'm 11 people away. No, 11, I wish. 41 people away. <laughs> but yeah, I want to try um, streaming more um, often. Should be nice. Okay, what's going on here? He's got like a skirty thing. Yeah. I hate those details. Super confuse me. They're him, yeah. Animating. They're confusing to put in. Like his skirt thing gets shorter and shorter every time. I feel like. <laughs> Getting more comfortable. <laughs> And his legs just got fatter for some reason. Oops. Keep uh, shaming him all the time. <laughs> huh, okay, so... Mm. That fly looks a bit better. Let me just see what happens. Do, 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 do. Interesting how um, when I watch a stream on your page, it, I don't have an option to like put it lower than 720p. Yeah, because I'm not... I don't know if you get that option with affiliate, but you definitely don't at the start. I feel oh, like. I see. Yeah. It's a bit that's, weird. That's like, why... I I, quality if I want to. That's why I normally can't um, watch streams on my internet. Because it just constantly buffers because my internet's awful. Yeah, that's pretty much what happens with me now. It constantly buffers. Hmm. I'm not sure if it's affecting its chat or not every time, and I have to refresh. Probably doesn't, though, because it's chat. Um... So, what's the plan, sir? Are we planning to have more of these? Uh... Is what? it going to be production value uh, added? Production value? What do you mean? To the stream. What do you mean? I'm talking about the streams of the game. I know how the game's going. <laughs> no, I'm saying to let the chat know how what's the plan with the streaming. Oh, the I just, I just one, I guess. plan to, to, to stream more. Or de definitely like within this month, I guess. Um, about twice a week. Ooh. Yeah, see, I didn't know that. 
Uh, I don't know when. It's just probably going to be whenever I'm free to do it. This looks weird. What is he doing? <laughs> okay. Oh, it's... Uh, it's not your well, fault. It's, it's my fault. It's my body. It's because I'm just copy-pasting the same All right. top, top half of him. Yeah, in this frame, he's losing control, basically, of that thing. Yeah. I'm fattening the bug for you at the moment. It's like squashed and stretched it and uh, made its wind smaller than its body. <laughs> I'm just like adding <laughs> fat to it and it looks funny. <laughs> yeah, the problem with like the rough anim it's not a problem, but the rough animations you do work. But then when I do it, there's like really slight changes like in the head that you might do to like help with the flow of the animation and I can't do that. <laughs> So yeah, I, I try and take that in consideration when it's like if I have to um, use the same frame, but just like I don't want to do like those subtlest of movements, I just like uh, move it up approximately yeah. one pixel. Yeah. With the same drawing. And then I keep in mind that, yeah, if he moves like diagonally or whatever, we don't I don't have more than one move to do that, I guess. Frames, uh, whatever. Move. Yeah, 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 yeah. No, it's just like a slight difficulty in the sense of the fact of the, the low res that I'm using. But um, it works in the end, usually. So, yeah, what I'm doing on my non-streaming uh, screen is that I'm drawing a, a bug that takes place that's like a part of some puzzle. Um, it's supposed to be flying. And, and after that, I have to draw... A, Carnivorous plant, which I have some references that I need to consult. Um, yeah, at first I was thinking of the Venus flytrap because of the mechanics of the open closed mouth that like almost looks like a you know proper mouth, I guess, even though yeah. it's a plant. Yeah. But the other one had like a little uh, hat, <laughs> the other uh, carnivorous plan. So mm -hmm. we could exploit that to show that it's like closing every time. I'm not sure if that actually how it works. I think can it you, doesn't. Can you I not think... find like videos of it in action? I well, I was a I was a nerdy kid with those plants. I used to have like the other one, the Venus flytrap, and I know that uh, this uh, plant. It's like you, bugs oh. go to it and they kind of slip in and fall. Yeah. So it doesn't really close its cap. I mean, we can do whatever we want technically, but compared to the Venus flytrap, that it just closes the mouth and then it just like keeps it closed until it disintegrates and it absorbs the, mm -hmm. the bug. So it technically might not be correct, but I mean, is my answer to that? Have you? Did you try finding any videos of that specific? No, type but. Of one? Well, I'm pretty sure it doesn't work the way I want it to work, uh, but I can find videos if you want. Yeah, I reckon Ooh. just check, and it might, it might. Yeah, but do we care if it's not real? <laughs> I think first check to see what it actually is like, and then we'll have creative like, license to do. Okay, so this plant I'm talking about is called... It's called... Blah, blah, blah. <laughs> so you don't know anything about uh, it's a blah blah blah. Plant you went to Matt says I went to a little talk about carnivorous plants in Kew Gardens earlier this year, just before the world went wrong. I'm not sure what time he's referring to. The world is fine. There are loads of different types. Yeah, I mean th there are. Uh, the thing is that there are some of them that are kind of lame for our purpose. They're just like underwater and they're like chill. Like we want some that look animated and have crazy colors. And the two plants that I'm thinking of. One is the, the most classic one, uh, which is called, well, it's called a Venus flytrap, I guess in layman's terms. Um, so, well, I mean, I'm, I'm just gonna... Yeah, the Venus flytrap is cool because it has this crazy mouth-looking leaves that just, like, trap the bug in it. And then, what's the other one I'm talking about? It's called... I don't know what it's called. Uh... Wait, is that it? Uh... 
Well, it looks so trippy. Uh, Jesus, yeah, maybe. I don't know. Cephalotus? Um, crazy looking thing. Have amazing colors. They're all like super pink or purple or whatever. <laughs> oh, there's one that looks like alien tentacles. It's crazy. Um, do, 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 do. Calling out, trying to find it. Yeah, I linked to you yesterday the name, but now I uh, missed it. Can you search in the chat, I guess? I don't know. That's what I'm doing, yeah. Yeah, you sent me a link on the 10, 10 most fascinating carnivorous plants. It is this. Well, it is the monkey cup. All right, Nepenides. monkey cup. It looks like. Devon saying, I have a meeting now. Have a good animation. Looks like it's already serial. Bye, thanks, thanks for joining. Yeah. yeah, so it's that that one. I've got it on stream. <laughs> yeah, let me link Mon this. Monkey cup. Yeah, that's the insane looking one. So monkey cup. Let's let's find the video. It's monkey cup. So the, you see this top there? I don't think it closes. Uh, monkey cup. Yeah. Monkey cup dress. Oh wait. Um, I'm not sure what else monkey cup means, but I mean the plan. <laughs> it's um, <laughs> Nepen wait, Nepen is Hold on. Let me copy paste you. Are you linking? Are you checking it out too? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, I found that. Um, oh, okay, okay. I thought you were struggling to find it. It's being called also uh, monkey cups. Refer wait, uh, as monkey cups it refers to the fact that monkeys have been observed drinking rainwaters from these plants. Oh, that's pretty cool to know. Cool. I just saw a video of some uh, dude in the jungle using it for a cup. Uh, <laughs> I got slightly disgusted, but sure. Uh, Oh man, this animation looks weird. Wait, weird? You mean perfect? No. Are oh, you talking about yours? Fine. Yeah, don't worry, not yours. True facts, carnivorous plants. Remember, wasn't there like um, in the Jurassic Park film, like that lady was a, uh, you know, botanologist. But other than the scene where they talk about the poop of the dinosaurs uh, having some plants, uh, yeah, they don't really talk anymore about about botany, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, botany yeah. or anything else. Oh, today um, so uh, they they announced the um, date of the new Jurassic Park, which basically all the new characters from the new ones and all the old characters. Oh, really? Like, yeah. Why, why are they getting back together? Like, what's the reasoning for that? Because m because they're gonna get a lot of money when the movie comes out. Oh, I guess geez. I have no idea. <laughs> I think uh, I think Jeff Goldblum was in the latest one, but yeah, as much as I love dinosaurs, I don't really like those films, uh, the latest ones, because they're uh... yeah they're. Yeah, it's weird liking dinosaurs so much and not liking those Jurassic Park films. I, I didn't mind like the first newer one, I guess, and then I watched that because you know that was the first one. I didn't know how it was gonna be. Yeah, but then wow, those Venus. I'm watching videos of Venus flytraps, and they're so fucking scary. Yeah, I don't think I've seen the latest one. Me neither. Uh, then there was a short film that they released, uh, which was basically like a post-apocalypse with dinos. Like they all escaped the park, and people were like trying to live their lives, but they were like in the jungle. Okay. Uh, which was kind of a cool idea. And I have no idea what the new one's like. Holy shit! This fly trap is eating a frog. Ugh. I didn't even know they can eat frogs. Probably it didn't know it can eat a frog until it caught one. Oh wow, there's 
is a really scary one as well. That looks like an alien tentacle that kind of like wraps around the fly slowly. Oh. Holy shit, that could be a good one too. Oh, there is this. oh, okay, so it does close this little cup. This monkey cup. It closes its cap. Yeah, let me see okay. the action again. Yeah, there's like a fucking liquid in there, and then it dissolves. Ew, okay. The flight does. Wait, 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 let me read. Make sure. Oh, wow, it's eating a spider. Yeah, it's fucking crazy. Uh, uh, uh. Oh, it's weird. One of them was closing it, and the other ones are chilling. Oh wow, it's gonna eat a mouse. A mouse? Flip. Not even like. Well, it looks like a mouse. It's more like a, like a tiny rodent, but rodent of some sort. I mean. Yeah, jungle, jungle rodent. Oh wow, this is gonna be ah uh, no the anticipation. Is it going to slip and fall, or is it going to close its mouth? Unless I'm just watching Rodent eat a carnivorous plant, I'm not sure what who's going to eat whom. <laughs> oh no. Oh no, it looks so cute. <laughs> it's like licking all around the plant, but... I know the name of the plant, which is kind of spoiling what's going to happen, but it's not happening yet. Can I get you to have a look at the animation in a moment, please? Excuse me, what? Do you mind having a look at the animation in a sec and helping me? Mm. Yeah, go you're, ahead. You're looking now, okay. Um, this frame is not right. What is wrong? <laughs> Well, the head stays the same. Oh, I know, but that's what I was trying to say. Is like, um, which frame is that supposed to be? It's these two, and on yours, like, it barely anything happens between the, the heads. Like, it's hard for me to do something. Is that's what I was trying to say? I don't think we need to move the head. But okay, it's the shoulders and is... stuff. The, the whole upper yeah, body moves too the... much, or something, or like. Well, I think that maybe the head uh, needs to move a bit to the left or something. Just like you want me to move the head to the left on this one. Maybe let's see. I mean, supposedly his shoulders move back, so yeah, looks better, right? Yeah, it looks better, but it's still. Yeah, I think you need to do something with his collar there, because his his uh, shoulder on the right, as we watch it, as yeah. we from, I mean, our right. Mm -hmm. Seems like uh, it should have like some, should be a bit higher or something. So with you, it's like back and then it goes kind of forward. Hmm, okay, so. I just like cover a little bit more or something. I don't know. I have to excuse myself for a minute. I'll be right back. Okay. okay.
<laughs> yeah, I like Ace Sprite. Um, I mean, the only one other one that I've yeah. used is uh, some one that was for Mac. But since I've started using a using a PC, I found Ace Sprite to pretty pretty good. I'm pretty sure there's a lot more it can do than I actually use as well. So yeah, I used to own a Venus flytrap when I was a kid. <laughs> kind of die fast though. Oh, really? Same like tons of water, and if you put a fly in one of the mouths, uh, it can either absorb it and become bigger, or it can like use so much energy to absorb it that it just like dies. The head. Mm -hmm. I'm still, I still don't have an answer if it closed its mouth or not. The mouse never did anything. I was just like watching this video for nothing. Uh, <laughs> Cephalotus follicularis is its other name. I mean, the scientific name, I guess. Sure, I'm not going to remember that. <laughs> Okay, so they're like in a cluster. It will be interesting for our um, bit because um, I don't want to spoil the game, but it has, I mean, there are people, the three of us, we know what happens in the game. Uh, there's like a part in the plant that you need to get out, uh, but it can probably be like a little bit see through the mouth, so you can like get a hint of a silhouette inside. Can it not be like sticking out as well a bit though? Yeah, that's what I was thinking initially, but it could be. And as long as the color of the plants like pretty different to the color of the bit, um, yeah, then it should be okay. It should be pretty obvious. Uh, AdventureX uh, announced uh, the Game Jam thing that they talked about. Oh, they're doing a Game Jam? Did I know this? Did you tell me? Yeah, we do because they said they're canceling AdventureX and uh, oh. they're doing this. They When's said that, that going to be? It's going to be in November. Oh, cool. The thing is, they don't have any prices. They just say, do it, have fun. <laughs> yeah, no, it's still and pretty it's, cool. It's only... Um, it's only a week though, it's not two. Mm -hmm. Like I mean, the other one. It's a lot more standard for uh, Game Jam. Two's pretty crazy. I mean, I don't know. I mean, I, Ludum like, Dare is like, what, two days or something? Yeah, this is insane. I would never do that. I mean, my skills are not there anyway, but so much crunching that you need to do, that's it, like insane. It was. Yeah. It was crunching for us and we did two weeks, but then again, I overscoped the whole thing, which sure. But I did, I did Ludum Dare as well. Oh, you did, yeah. The, <laughs> the Fluffy Horde one. Yeah. Oh, wow. I haven't done Ludum Dare. I haven't done any... I, I've only done it in films, like a 48-hour contest. And I guess yeah. we did one together. Yeah. Yeah, it's... it's. I mean, I, I didn't do around. much. Well, I mean, you <laughs> stayed awake and you went around, so it's still involved. the same stress. <laughs> Yeah, but you still have the same stress is going to be done in time yeah, or not. Like, yeah. as the whole team has. Are you doing the game jam, Matt? Yeah, I was going to ask Matt. <laughs> yeah, I I'd like to, but there's no way we'd be able to. Like, I wanted to take part in October as well. <clears throat> but I think we have lo like way too much stuff to do to be able to do that as well. Uh, that is true. I mean, it's kind of nice to take a break too, but also, <laughs> yeah. I'm happy at the moment because, like, I'm not programming now and we're doing some actual pixel art <clears throat> instead. So for me, this is a break. 
been programming, so I'm happy. That'd be cool if you do it, Matt. <laughs> You, are you going to do it by yourself, Matt, if you are, if you are doing it? Also, there was just like a game jam, but for some super weird reason, I think because it was sponsored by Unity or something, it was like, you can make an adventure game, but it has to be Unity only. Mm. And it uh, it ended yesterday, and it had like 10 games or less. Oh. Maybe, yeah, maybe it's because it was just Unity. But a lot of people use Unity, I feel like. That's true, but then you like specify mm -hmm. so much that it has to be narrative, it has to be adventure, it has to be mm -hmm. Unity. That uh, apparently you need to ban some bot that's in the chat. Ban a bot? Oh, right, yeah. How do I do this? How do I do this? I need to make some people mods for me. Bear with me. Can I do it from my phone? Oh, there we go. Ban user. Thanks. Oh, I found a David Attenborough documentary on uh, carnivorous plants. He's going <laughs> to stick his fingers in their mouths, I guess. I haven't watched any nature documentary stuff for a long time. Yeah, I really enjoyed uh, Planet Earth too. That was yeah. like gorgeous. I haven't seen anything since then. I, I always feel weird watching documentaries about dinosaurs because there's so much 3D fakeness. I mean, obviously, they can't have real dinosaurs. Yeah, yeah. That, but, but also, they look like PlayStation 1 graphics. And I'm like, <laughs> yeah, no, thanks. I can watch Jurassic Park if I want fake dinos. Plants are creepy, they're just moving their leaves all around, like tentacles. <laughs> this looks alien. So it's weird because when they uh, blossom or whatever, they have their little caps on and then they like, it looks like they're closed and they open up, but I can't find them doing the opposite where they close the cap. By the cap, do you mean that little leaf on the top? Yes, that, that leaf remains, that leaf is basically closed until they like blossom, I guess, and then it opens. Okay. And then it's like ready to eat. Yeah, basically, it's like a little uh, dinner bell trap. <laughs> yeah, well, I mean, it's a little trap that the uh, things go to like get juicy nectar and then they like slip and fall down and then they get trapped there. And the plant is basically just chilling there until they fall in. <laughs> it's also hanging super creepily. Yeah, okay. Uh, that might not work because they don't close their heads. Do they actually? I mean, you can just do it anyways, right? Sure. There's also a creepier one. Um, wait. But I haven't shown you yet. I'm watching a video saying 10 carnivor carnivorous plants you won't believe, episode one. How many episodes are there? I mean, I can't. I won't believe it in the first one, but <laughs> well, unless this guy's hands on and he had like throws them.
buttons. Do, 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 do. That's a, there's a very creepy one, but I'm not sure if it's going to translate in pixels. Why? Because it's like has tiny, tiny, um, thin. Ah, I'm trying to find the name so I can speak like a normal person. I mean, even if I can say the Latin, you understand them, but not that I understand Latin. It's just like weird names, but. Uh -huh. So, can I show you a picture at least? Okay, it's this. Wait. Yeah. It's this bullshit plant. Yeah, I'm not sure if that's going to translate the pixels, but it basically looks like tentacles with tiny tentacles on them. Oh, yeah. So this kind of like wraps around the bug, and it also rolls around the bug. How big is it? Is it tiny? Or a spider. Uh, I'm not sure, but they're kind of long, I guess. I mean, I saw it trapping a spider that looks almost like a tarantula size, so maybe it's... Um... What's this bullshit called? Um, oh, maybe it's on the list you like me. What is it? I, I don't know if like just a normal Venus flytrap would be best, or at least it would be the clearest of what to do with it, if you know what I mean. Um, well, it is clear, in my opinion, because it has, uh, it looks so much like a mouth, that thing it has, that it's, a it closes and it opens, a like, clearly. A normal Venus flytrap. Yeah. Yeah, I feel like that might be the best option to go with. Yeah, as, and you as can make it look well. cooler with colors and stuff like that. Yeah, exactly. I mean, I I don't think they're wait prehistoric. I mean, it's kind of like a bit too specific, but prehistoric carnivorous plants. Am I gonna find anything? <laughs> Man, spaceman. I'm pretty spaceman. sure there were prehistoric carnivorous plants. Seven clever carnivorous plants, as opposed to the stupid ones. What is this list? <laughs> <laughs> There's the one from Little Sob of Horrors. That sings as well. Stupid website wants me to disable my ad blocker. Let me see plans. Spending way too much time on this plant. Uh, oh. That will do. Yeah, okay. So this is the same oh, frame. Nice. I like it when you draw the exact same frame and I just need to copy paste. Yeah, it's uh, a. <laughs> I mean, you do, but you need to move it a little bit. Okay. No, and his arm goes up in the cape, but the rest is pretty much the same, I think. All oh, right. So it's secondary movement. Yeah, I try to do that here. Yeah, I think the Venus flytrap is only trapped. It looks like a carnivorous plant. The other ones look like flowers or. Hey, what's going on? <laughs> Ooh, someone followed. I missed that. Thank you very much for following you, even though it was like 10 minutes ago. Sorry I missed it. 40 more followers to go. I unfollow. You unfollowed. Do you follow me? Uh, yeah, I tried to make a pun, but uh, I also might not follow you. For reals? No, I, I am. I think you following. do. I think you do. <gasps> Matt! 
Matt doesn't follow me. Sad. I think it's on purpose. So sad. <laughs> Only in real life. Yeah, yeah, Larry. I you can help me with that later. To so, what is it like? Is there a bot that can automatically delete um, obvious um, spammy stuff? Yeah, rare, I guess. Hmm? No, nothing. I'm I, I'm trying to remember from like the four times I've streamed. I was using Streamlabs, but that was probably for or having little animations on screen for people following and stuff. Uh, yeah, yeah. There's a lot that I need to learn to do. Pretty sure, like, during the Kickstarter, you made some uh, banners and stuff for the streaming. Yeah, yeah, I did. I don't know that I'm gonna... I don't know, we'll see. I don't wanna get like too bogged down with stuff because I wanna make sure I am actually working as well. Did Matt follow? Is it, is it on record? Yes, Matt did follow. Thank you very much, Matt. So what's the weather like now that's in England, now that it's officially October? <laughs> what does that got to do with it? I don't know, I'm from Greece. We don't have your weather. Does your weather officially change when it's the 1st of October? No, 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 it's super warm here. Like, still t-shirts. Yeah. It's just like, oh, nice. it's, it's like tropical climate almost. It's like so much uh, humidity. It's cold here. Um, it was raining a lot. Lately, not right now. It's just, yeah, but we had some sunshine this morning. Yay. Only two more sunshines left this year for you then. <laughs> I mean, who knows with like how global warming's going at the moment? Things are crazy. Oh, it's sunny for you, Matt. It's gone like grey now. It was sunny earlier, though. I'm not sure geographically how far your place is from Matt's place. Uh, Without me wanting to tell everyone where you guys live. I mean, I'm pretty pretty far from oh, right. London, and I'm like right in the south uh, west. So, like, I'm pretty far from anyone in, in England. <laughs> yeah, I think it's far. I never know how to do hands. What? Nothing. But yeah, this frame's going to be seen for like a not very long at all, so no one's going to like comment. Yeah, the jazz yeah, hands because I I just decide to add fingers whenever I feel like. <laughs> I know, but like like normally the the hands are just like a cross. Um, so I'm oh, saying right. I never know how to do hands, but they're barely going to see be seen for long, so it doesn't really matter. Like if you froze this frame, it would look a bit weird, probably. What bot, Joe? Oh, what bot? What bot? I need that bot. We will. <laughs> 
Yeah, that'd be pretty cool to have to, if there's a bot that automatically um, bans people. Bad people. Adds people, not bots, just people. Hmm? Bans bots, yeah. Did I use the wrong colors on the last frame? Nah. I made that uh, unnamed cor dino corpse uh, smaller, by the way. Oh, thanks. I could have just done that. Like. Yeah, but I mean, yeah. I guess. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, we we need to tell Matt about this eventually. About Doesn't what? Doesn't super matter, but. Uh, about the corpse of the dino being smaller than we thought, so... But I haven't shown him what the dinosaur's going to look like. I was just waiting until we've done it, and then I'll show send him the actual dinosaur. Okay, well, yeah. I guess I did it now, though. Yeah, I'll, I'll um, draw it next, I guess. Um, like it's my next priority. <laughs> Joel says, can you show us an alternate color of the spaceman, like a shiny Pokemon? <laughs> Imagine if that was like a an extra feature of the game where you can like just change the skin colors. As in like I, the Amazon's I, I'm, not in like brown anymore. I'm pretty, sure, in, like, I, uh, I'm pretty sure we have this on the Kickstarter page. Uh, it's like a billion kicks a billion colors for him. Yeah. I could do that right now. There? Wait, look. You can change, like, um, uh, how do you do this? I did many Pokemon colors for him. Uh, look, look. There we go. Does that make you happy, <laughs> Joe? <laughs> oh, flippin' look. Uh, yeah. Pink and turquoise. A backer requested an update for Therapods. We just had a ba an update a month ago. Yeah, we should do another, think about doing another one soon. <laughs> you can be any colour you want him to be. We can do um, an update soon and also like mention that we're going to be streaming more, like the process, if anyone wants to join. Yeah, other than that announcement, I'm not sure what else we could show them. Um, we could show a clip of the prototype, but like in a way that it doesn't um, spoil anything. Uh, technically, we haven't shown a couple of prototypes. We haven't shown some action sequences. We haven't shown any of the prototype, I don't think. Yeah, action sequences. We, there's like, we, there's did. A, we did. We did. We? we did in the latest. Yeah. Um, oh, I don't remember. Easy. Well, the latest one was all about rough stuff, I guess, right? So we did show the mountain cliff thing. Oh, okay. So we have shown some. Did we, show, did we show any of the action? Uh, I don't think so. So we could show some of that, yeah. Say that we've been playing around with it. Oh, there he is. Yeah, you can show this if you want. Pokemon Spaceman. I've actually just then changed his color to like stuff like that anyways. Yeah, but I've done it already. <laughs> did you see it? Yeah, I did, I did. I was watching when you were doing it. There we go. <laughs> yeah, we tried to match them against the jungle background so we could see what's more visible. Yeah, I'm quite happy with the color that we went with in the end. 
Yeah, it also works for the stone and all that, I guess. been streaming for an hour already has it been i was, I was about to try and work out how long i think i'll just stream until the end of this animation if you're cool with that yeah i'm sure i mean up to you i was worried it wouldn't take an hour but it looks like it did As you see, uh, yesterday Baldur's Gate 3 got released for early access. Uh, I did not see. It basically broke Steam. <laughs> <laughs> that was pretty cool. It was really cool because I was watching some uh, Twitch streams, and what they've done is they added a, an add-on. So when you have, you know, you have options to like uh, to talk to people in those uh -huh. RPGs, like you can select one, two, three, or four, or whatever. Uh -huh. And uh, the chat can basically select for you, so it shows you like uh, immediately you get like all the numbers, and the chat votes on what kind of answer you oh, want. Okay, so that's kind of interesting how they managed to do that. <laughs> they look really cool, actually. Yeah, uh, the game it looks yeah it felt like the old Baldur's Gate, and it it was playing a lot more on the roll dice for uh, uh -huh. like from the you know D and D uh, for. It also has a narrator telling you what you feel and stuff like that at times, Ooh. like a voiceover. So that's pretty cool. Yeah, I don't even know that I've played Baldur's Gate. Yeah, I was a huge Baldur's Gate yeah, too fan. I know you. Fan were. When I was younger. Yeah. Uh, so, like, I didn't play any D and D, but all my interaction with D and D was through Baldur's Gate. And uh, that world from Forgotten Realms, so that's pretty mm -hmm. cool. So I, I, played, I know all the mind players and all those creatures. I played Neverwinter Nights, which was Forgotten yes, I think Realms. It's exactly the same world. Yeah. But I don't think that 3D aged well. <laughs> I didn't like it back then. Yeah. yeah. Even this one, like I don't like the top-down graphics as much as I like the old one, but I really like the you know the camera going closer and you can see the characters properly and reacting, kind of like the Mass Effect games. Mm -hmm. But it's a bit weird how your character like talks randomly uh, occasionally, but when he has his dialogue options, he doesn't talk. You just immediately hear the yeah the other person, but sometimes he talks and say, "Let's go that way." Uh, I don't know why they're not consistent. Maybe it's early access, but... Mm. What the heck is this frame that you drew? <laughs> the arms! <laughs> oh, it's him going... Uh, it's him, like, going back to the normal position. I know, but what the heck? <laughs> don't judge my individual frames. You're not going to be able to see it like that. <laughs> yeah, but it's in movement. It. The dance frames is mad. <laughs> oh, I don't know what I'm doing.
Are you singing the dinosaur? Is that like your your theme song for when you work on theropods? Yeah, so basically for the last five years. <laughs> Fly colors. Perhaps I'll do this. I'm not sure if you're going to be able to do that in pixels, so it doesn't even matter what detail I'm adding, I guess. Uh, yeah. Oh, his face moves? His face moves, okay. I'm not sure if anyone cares, but we can let them know that we messaged the people who are designing the dinosaurs from the Kickstarter, that we had the reward. Oh, that would be cool on an update as well. Oh, to announce them? Not to announce the dinosaurs, because we don't fully know exactly what uh, we're, yeah. we're choosing to go in, because we have to wait to hear back from everyone, but it'd be cool to let everyone know that we're at that stage of, like... Yeah, Thinking yeah. Basically, we had just explained to chat. We had um, one of the Kickstarter rewards was that you can pick your own dinosaur and we can design it with you to be in the game. And since we're at this stage now that we need to know all of our dinosaurs, uh, we asked them and we have a few options. So that's pretty cool. But the problem was that uh, I mean, well, we got a T Rex in the game, but let's say someone said, "I want a T Rex." Uh, T-Rexes are generally pretty big and our characters are pretty small and our camera is fixed. So we didn't want to add like a huge dino that you can only see its foot uh, <laughs> in the like, in-game camera. So we warned everyone that if you pick like a really large dino, it has to be like sort of in the background if it's going to work. Uh, so yeah, preferably let's pick a smaller one. Otherwise, I mean, you can still have it, but it's not going to be like very prominent. But I think we have some good uh, suggestions. Yeah, yeah, for sure. That we... Yeah, some of them are like basically dinosaurs that you kind of know, but like a subspecies in a way, if that makes sense. Uh, you know what I'm talking about? I guess. Yeah, so it's like a kind of a different design of a dinosaur that everyone's familiar with, sort of, that I didn't know it existed, so that's pretty cool. It's like hipster uh, choices for a dinosaur. I don't quite know why the animation doesn't want to play, by the way. It's all work and no play. Oh, dear. Hmm. Anyways, do you want to have a look and see what you think? No, I'm good. Yeah, sure. But it, uh, it's not going to be at the correct frame rate. You looking? Ooh, that looks really nice, the cape. Yeah, I think it works. <laughs> you happy? Yeah, I'm, I'm good. We're gonna, yeah, we're gonna do the timing whenever, but it's fine. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'll stick it in game and then we'll see what we think. The hands actually look okay. okay. Cool. Okay then, thanks, Joe. Nice little animation. Right, well, I think that's it for today then. Well, not for today. <laughs> well, that, for that's today, my right? that's my work done for today. <laughs> No, that's the stream for today. Um, next time, I don't quite know what to do or when it will be. Um, I can't. It caught me by surprise. I wasn't even sure when you were going to stream. Yeah, I was just like now. <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I might need a new animation, but you haven't done any yet, have you? Wait, what? You've done everything else? No, I just uh, I don't know what else there'll be that's going to be interesting to do. Oh, I mean, but I pretty I much know. have done everything else. 
Oh, really? Have you, you did him... How many other animations do you have? Well, so I've got him using the fire extinguisher, the fire extinguisher flying away. Is there another one? Oh, I've using done the... The, the what? The rod? Yeah. That's this one. Oh, Matt is starting, starting the background tomorrow. <gasps> Exciting. You're going to stream it? No pressure, you don't have to. <laughs> yeah, we don't have to pressure you. Everyone else in the chat can. No. But we also, uh, like, the problem is we don't want to spoil way too much. Because this is the, the, yeah, no the, rod, the, rod, <laughs> the rod animation. Oh, nice. Yeah, ooh. The cape is really <laughs> like, cool. Yeah, I'm paying a lot of attention to the cape now. It's nice how it's translating. Uh, maybe... Okay, well, there's one frame that I'm looking at. This one. Mm -hmm. This one. Before that one? This one. Before that one. This one. Okay, this one. <laughs> uh, I'm nitpicking now, but... Yeah, no, it's fine. Does it feel like the cape at the back behind his right arm, right from our side, goes a little bit to the left, or...? This or one, you're saying there should be more. Bouncy. There should be yeah. more. But you made it so bouncy that it makes sense, actually, so it might be fine. Yeah, the I fact, I think I'll it... I yeah, no, I see what you mean. Feels like it's going way too left while well, it should be a tiny little bit there. I mean, it's, yeah, it's fine. That's too much now, isn't it? I see it. Uh, there needs to be a little bit at the bottom, I think. But other than that, it looks... Oh, see I see what you mean. That huge gap there. You mean down here? Yeah. Is that weird? Yeah. Work. Because you know why? Because the, the top of it is the most is supposed to be the most oh, stable. Works. Yeah. Yeah, it works. Because the top of his shoulders is where it's all like uh, almost stuck together. Does that disappear too quickly? Here. I didn't even notice that. Let me see. So this nah, one, those two frames. Fine. You happy? Fine, okay. Fine. okay. So his foot looks so freaking weird. The feet are really weird to draw. <laughs> it's fine. Because it goes in the background, like the distance. And sometimes my feet are way too cartoony. I, I realize that when I anyway. But... You also, I mean, it doesn't matter. I'm not asking you to change it, but like they're a lot longer than they actually <laughs> are. But um, that's fine because I can just. Yeah, I know you fix it, but also the, because of the exaggeration, it works sometimes. Uh. Mm. Okay, okay then. I like how I was kind of thinking about the rod being how to design it, and it's literally a stick. Like, you don't even need to design it. I try doing it thicker, and when you do things thicker, it just looks kind of weird. Kind of like the, sp the um, extinguisher thing, but I think this one needed to be thicker. Yeah, true. And also, yeah, it needs to be thicker because you pick it up from somewhere before that. Mm-hmm. But um, I think the rod's going to okay, work okay with one line. But I can easily change that if it needs to be thicker. Yeah, sure. Yeah. Okie doke. Well, I'm going to say goodbye to everybody. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you for being around. We're going to do this again. Thank you for the follows. Um, I didn't follow you, sir. You follow me already. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Thanks for yeah, joining, Matt. Oh, like, and then maybe maybe we'll have a private stream with Matt so we can see what he's doing for us. <laughs> <laughs> right. Um, yeah. Okay, bye-bye, guys. How do I stop this? Okay, cool. Yeah. Bye. Thanks again. Catch you again sometime <laughs> soon. Yeah. We'll tweet about it, most likely. But yeah, follow me, and then you'll know when it'll be. <laughs> yeah. Tweet about it, and if you don't catch it within the hour, it's gone. I mean, it saves it, right, for you. I think it keeps VODs for like two weeks. All right. Unless I download okay. it, but yeah. Yeah. Okay, dikes. Okay, bye-bye. Bye. -bye. bye.